Hey everybody, it's Tiffany here. Happy International Scrapbooking Day. I think this is the third year that we have hosted International Scrapbooking Day activities in our Facebook group, and I'm thrilled that you've decided to join us this time. Maybe this is like a tradition for you now, which is awesome, so welcome back if that's the case. Or maybe you're brand new. Well, that's pretty awesome too. We're thrilled that you found us and that you've decided you want to join in in some of our community activities. I think it's a pretty awesome place to hang out because people are encouraging and inspiring and warm. And that's what we want all of you to be able to experience here on International Scrapbook Day, but also every other day of the year. So what can you expect today? We'll have a new contributor who posts a challenge every hour on the hour from 7 a.m. Central Time until midnight Central Time. I was trying to think about you early birds and you night owls and those of you who might live in Europe or down under, and I wanted to make sure that everyone had a chance to access some of our challenges in real time. Each contributor is different, and so each challenge is different. You might want to try to take part in every single challenge, which is fabulous, but you might also decide that only four or five of the challenges work with your time and what you're interested in. That's totally okay too. Some of our contributors are going to post videos. Some of them will be like process videos. Others might be people just talking to you like I'm doing now. Um, it, it, it's up to the individual person who decided to help us out with our International Scrapbooking Day activities. Other people might include like um, instructions and still photos. And then there are some contributors who might also send you to an outside link, like to their personal blogs or something like that, in case you want more information or instruction. I encourage you to check those things out for sure. Some of the challenges will include giveaways or prizes, so be sure that you pay attention to the deadlines and the rules for those things because each contributor set that for herself and her own challenge. Now, what if you can't scrapbook today? Some of us have things that we have to do otherwise. You know, maybe someone in your family is getting married or there's a ball game you can't miss or something like that. Personally, I'm going to be traveling today and tomorrow, so I'm not going to be able to play along with you guys in real time. Don't worry. If that applies to you, if you missed it and you're watching this video way later, or if you have other things that you've already been obligated to today, that's not a big deal because these challenges will remain in our Facebook group indefinitely. Now, it might mean that you don't qualify for some of the giveaways or the prizes, but that's not really the point of International Scrapbook Day. I think the point is to build your community of people who enjoy the hobby as much as you do and to maybe challenge yourself to push yourself to try some things that you might or not ordinarily try on your own. I know some of our contributors have some amazing things planned for you. We have card makers. We have people who might want you to try a new format. We have people who might want you to scrapbook about a topic you haven't tried. Someone who might make you uh, take a picture you hadn't thought of, of shooting. We have people who are interested in mixed media, people who use splatter and stamping and all kinds of things. So I think that there will be something today for everybody. I plan to pop in here and there to see how the day is going and to offer you guys some encouragement and some feedback if you are looking for it. But please let me know if you encounter any problems or you have any questions as we go along. Keep in mind that every contributor is going to post her own challenge. And while we're shooting for on the hour, every hour, sometimes, you know, our clocks are different. <laughs> sometimes technology, you know, hates us or whatever. So please be patient if we're a couple of minutes early or a couple of minutes late for our challenges. I definitely think it'll be worth the wait. I need to get ready for my trip. 
but I hope you all have already stocked up on adhesive, that you've printed some photos, that you've given your families instructions, that you are now in the scrapbook zone, and that you're ready to get started with some fun International Scrapbook Day challenges. You know what I'm gonna say, right? Go and be crafty.